Hello, hello, and welcome back to your favorite channel for all things Roblox, Blox Crawler. I hope you're having an amazing day. In today's video, we're going to be comparing Megan Plays versus It's Funny, answering the question, who is the real Roblox queen? Now, before we begin with today's topic, I want you to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and turn on the notifications so you don't miss out on any of our upcoming videos. So without further ado, let's get right in. Fans of the Roblox community can't help but compare who the real Roblox queen in the industry is. And up to this point, people are now curious on who deserves the title between Megan Plays and It's Funny. The two are without a doubt some of the most promising YouTubers of today's time, and it really shows. But at the end of the day, who brings home the crown? Let's first start with virality and fame. This seems like an easy competition, but honestly, it's much more complicated than that. Funny started to create her YouTube channel back in 2011, and up to today, it has over 4 billion views on various videos. She was actually still in high school when she got her start and shelved making YouTube for a bit and focused us on school. But after she graduated, she returned to making YouTube videos and pumped out gaming content on a regular basis. In the beginning, most of her videos were done in collaboration with her sister Kim, a fellow YouTuber under the name of Golden Glare. And as of today, It's Funny has 7.93 million subscribers on her channel. Megan Plays, on the other hand, started her career a bit later. She started in 2014, three years later than It's Funny. As of now, she has 3.9 million subscribers and still increasing rapidly. She actually built her channel strategically. She owns three different YouTube channels named Megan Plays Roblox, Honey the Unicorn Roblox, and Perry the Panda Roblox, on which she uploads adorable style, entertaining vlogs, and gaming videos. So it's not comparable up to this point because Megan made sure she filters out her audience depending on their interests. True enough, It's Funny has much wider influence, but remember, it was co-built by her sister and later on, the crew, which are all of her siblings. Megan really took a toll on building the career all by herself, without the help of anyone. Megan Plays gained a huge fan following in a very short amount of time, and has accumulated millions of subscribers on her YouTube channels, so fame is definitely subjective for the two to compete in. Another one is versatility. A lot of people can't help but to compare Megan Plays to It's Funny, saying she deserves more merit than Kat. Megan Plays is actually known for creating Let's Play videos of games from Diablo, Sims, Minecraft, and much more meaning she's very much versatile. However, some argue that It's Funny has a greater sense of influence since she only plays one game, but she still made a better performance than Megan. Some people think Megan tries so hard and works tirelessly, resulting in burnout that she once discussed in a video. Another point of comparison that people can't help but compare is the fact that Megan Plays used her physical appearance to attract more viewers. A lot of people consider Megan Plays as young and beautiful, with an attractive and charming personality, and for some people, this really redirects people from following her instead of following her based on her gameplay. People think that she really used this as an advantage to attract more followers, and it's not very child-friendly, according to some. Lastly, their net worth. It's Funny has a net worth of around $38.11 million, which she earns through her channel, merchandise sales, and paid appearances. With an average of 5 million unique videos a day, it's really not impossible that It's Funny would earn this much. Megan has an estimated net worth of around 8.96 million, and this is crazy for some people because it's actually pretty high. But we all know that this is nothing compared to It's Funny, and some people think that Funny wins this round. Now we want to hear your thoughts on this. At the end of the day, we think that Megan Plays and It's Funny are both equal YouTubers, and we can't really decide who the real Roblox queen is. They're both wonderful in their own ways. Who do you think should be the queen of Roblox? Do you think Megan or Kat? Why or why not? Make sure to let us know. But that's all we have for you guys today. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, be sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for more Roblox content like this and much more. Until we see you guys next time, watch the two videos that are on your screen and we'll see you guys in another video.